Hello guys and welcome to Wounded Trading. Today I would like to carry on with the second video in our series of how to integrate and create bots on Hyperliquid Exchange. In the first one we already showed you how to establish the connection between Hyperliquid Exchange and Wounded Trading. In today's video I really want to talk to you about the DCA bot and how easy it is to set it up on Wounded Trading. So the DCA bot is a very classical dollar cost averaging strategy, which means that you scale into the position into the more favorable pricing. So if the asset is going not in your direction, there is an opportunity for you to average your position to get the better entry prices and then to exit when the take profit target is reached or when the indicator will tell you to exit according to your strategy. So let's switch to the dashboard in Wunder Trading right now and I will show you how to create the bot. Okay, so now you are in the Wunder Trading dashboard. You can see the DCA bot card over here and if you click on the open button it will automatically open the DCA bot tab. Over here you will find the small tutorial on what is dollar cost averaging, the product tour which will explain how to create your first DCA bot and if you want to learn more, you can all the time visit our help center in order to understand all the features and functionality that is available for you. For a quick start, I would usually go into the left column over here, which is called the profit optimized pairs. Those pairs are optimized for the last 14 days. They went through several parameters and they tried to find the most profitable setting parameters. To find those for the Hyperliquid Exchange, just select the Hyperliquid perps inside and it's going to be sorted out for you. Don't forget to select the Hyperliquid perps over here as well in order to match those settings. If you click the copy button over here, all the settings are going to be automatically applied. So you can see for IP USDC pair, the Maximum number of orders is 20, the price deviation is 1.59, the order size multiplier and the price deviation multiplier is already applied. If you invest only $50 on this strategy and all the maximum number of DC orders is going to be filled, the total amount will be $2,607 that you need to have available on your balance. If you have less than that, but you still want to open all of them, make sure that the leverage is also set for more than one on your exchange. So let's have a look at the backtest. The backtest result for this particular strategy is quite good. So the realized PL is $86 and current unrealized position is minus $3. But what you can see from the backtest is that this optimized strategy is built on the idea of high volatility. So it will enter the new trades immediately as soon as the take profit of the previous one is hit and it will collect this safety orders and then exit once the take profit is reached. You can twiggle any settings the way you want. So for example, if you set the take profit target smaller and then press the backtest button, the new backtest is going to be generated and you're going to see that the realized PNL decreased because we decreased the take profit targets, but the current position is still the same. At the same time, if you want to go back to the optimize settings, just click the optimize button and it will automatically provide you with the best results. Then applies those settings and your bot is now ready to run. Okay, so let's now just start the bot. As soon as the bot is created, and because our bot start condition is immediate, that means that we're going to enter the position straight away. So let's have a look at the position tab first of all here. So yes, we do have an entry over here. And let's check the Hyperliquid Exchange as well. In the Hyperliquid Exchange, you can see that the position was already created and one limit order is also pending. Uh, in order to have the safety order ready for you. So let's have a look on the graph. Yes, we can see the entry condition over here. We can see the first limit entry, which is our safety order. 
and I will just leave this bot as it is right now to see how it's gonna deliver. The DCA bot on Wunder Trading gives you multiple options on how to create it, how to adjust it, and what features are available. So if you don't want to have an immediate entry, it is also straightforward that we do have some pre-built indicators, such as RSI, MACD, Bollinger Bands, and price changes. All the settings of those indicators you can find in our help center. But let's have a look, for the sake of the example, how the RSI will work. So what I would usually do is that I will select the RSI and usually the bot in the long direction will wait until the RSI will be in the oversold region. I would select the indicator and then I would run the optimize. On the optimize you would be able to see what are the parameters, what and how the um, bot will enter, where exactly it will occur. Obviously it will have lesser number of trades but it's a very safer option in order to catch this volatility then you can apply the settings once again all of them are going to be applied over here and you can create a bot using the RSI indicator a very similar story for the MACD and the Bollinger Bands the price change is slightly different so the price change will measure the change of the price based on the 15 minute time frame so if you select the price change to be 2%, that means that a single candle over here, because we are on a 15 minute time frame here, should be more than 2% drop. Only after that, the entry will occur. If you just want to play around with the settings and see how they will operate under different conditions, you can also set up a paper trading account on Hyperliquid. In order to do that, just go to my exchanges, add the exchange, go to the demo session, and create Hyperliquid account. And then you would be able to test the DCA board and all the settings that you want without risking any of your funds. Two hours later. Okay guys, it's been almost two hours uh, since we launched the DCA board uh, based on the optimized settings. So let's just have a look at the stats. Going back to the DCA bots, okay. Uh, what we can see right now is that uh, four trades were already completed and it's one uh, trade which is currently open with the unrealized of minus 1.3 dollars and the total net pnl at the moment including the unrealized is four dollars 78 so let's have a look at the positions the current one uh, we already at the second stage of our safety order so the two orders were already filled and the third one is currently pending as a limit order and those were the trades that were completed so um, out of four orders, um, three of them just entered and exit. So we had just one out of 20 orders over here. And the, this one uh, had extra orders in it. Okay, let's have a look at the Hype Liquid Exchange and how it looked on there. All right, so this is our current position. This is exactly where we started the bot um, around two hours ago. Um, and you can see all the history over here. You can see the trade history of those positions and the uh, closed PNLs on all of them. So if you sum those up, you will definitely get the same result. Um, okay, so um, as you can see, um, within the two hours, the bot made already a couple of trades. Um, this is particularly a relevant DCA bot for the market with the medium volatility. So have a look at our DCA bot, uh, play around with the settings, uh, see um, what are the different options and conditions on how to enter or exit the trades, run a couple of back tests, and you can easily apply it on a hyperliquid exchange. That's it for this video and best of luck with your trading.